6 Weirdest Things Ever Stolen Number 6 Marla Maple's Shoes In 1992, the then-girlfriend of Donald Trump noticed a little something strange about her closet. Over 40 pairs of her shoes were missing. Not thinking it was likely they just walked away on their own, Maples installed a hidden surveillance camera. After watching the footage, she discovered that it was her own publicist, Chuck Jones, who had liberated the footwear. All of the shoes were discovered in his closet along with an impressive collection of shoe fetishist literature. Number 5. An Entire Front Lawn Denise Thompson was minding her own business one day when she suddenly discovered something quite shocking. She'd been robbed. After bringing her children out to visit her husband at work that morning, Denise returned home and gazed out her window to catch a glimpse of her lush front lawn. Only, it wasn't there anymore. All of the grass and plants that had made up her lawn were missing. She was staring at an empty patch of dirt. Later, neighbors told her that they had seen a truck and a trailer parked out in front of the house and figured that they had been hired. Worst landscapers ever. Number 4. Voltaire the body of this philosopher was stolen from his resting place by his nephew in order to give him a proper burial fit for the snappy dresser he was. Voltaire had spoken negatively about the church in life and was refused a Christian burial because no one can hold a grudge like the church can. That didn't stop his nephew from breaking into the Abbey of Salaries and burying him though. Number 3. Einstein's Brain Einstein, the man with the world's largest brain, dropped dead of internal bleeding at Princeton University. The body was eventually cremated, but was missing one very important organ, Einstein's brain. Don't worry though, this wasn't the beginning of a zombie apocalypse. The sneaky pathologist Thomas Stoltz stole the brain and kept it for experimentation for over 40 years. Number 2. Sex Toys one Oregon woman fell victim to a very sexual thief in 2013. The thief ended up taking off with a whole trunk load of sex toys that the owner had purchased for a friend's upcoming bachelorette party. The officer who took her details laughed while taking the incident report and presumably said, Sure, it was for your friend. Number 1. Napoleon Bonaparte's Penis now you have permission to get your head firmly in the gutter. After Napoleon departed this world, he was parted with a favorite appendage. A doctor from Corsica performed an autopsy and left with a pretty strange souvenir, Napoleon's joystick. This was sold on a number of times and as far as we know, it's now in New Jersey while Napoleon himself rests in Paris. Of course, it may not even be Napoleon's. The French government has apparently never accepted it as such, but thanks to an x-ray taken by Dr. Latimer, we do know this much, it's definitely someone's penis.